Paul Tisdale, end of a long day, share of the points. Is that acceptable? Firstly, it's not the end. We've got a long trip home. <laughs> yeah. Then we'll call it the end of the day. We've come here with a point. We've taken a point away. Um, the day was a mess. An absolute mess from you know, the hour and a half we had to wait to kick off to some of our play in the first half, but then we rectified it. And then some of the, some of the decisions with the players, with the referee, with, it was a mess. Um, I don't know whether we should have done better at the end or not. We got a point. We got a point and often these days turn into even worse days. And it hasn't. We've come away with a point, we've come a long way. We've got a point and let's just take it and go home. Let's go back before the kickoff, that hour and a half. How difficult was that for you and the squad? It, it, it was very difficult, but it was difficult for everybody. Yeah. I mean, difficult for the people running around trying to, the barrow people trying to rectify the problem. It was difficult for their players as well as our players. Difficult for all supporters who had to wait. It, it was just, it was a mess and no one's fault that I, I know of. And Barry did extremely well to get the game on, and so well done to them. We all wanted to play it. Everyone was patient. Um, yeah, I mean, they don't give you a, a chapter on your pro license to tell you how to <laughs> coach that hour and a half or deal with it. We just sat at a cup of tea and just. And the worst thing was not knowing when the game was going to start. Yeah. At first, yeah. it was going to be three fifteen, then three thirty. So that was really difficult. Just not sure. And so sometimes you've just got to take a deep breath and be philosophical about it but both sides were ready to go at the, at the, at the start at 4.30 eventually and uh, actually it was quite a good game I mean it was actually quite a good game as much of a mess as it was it was quite a good game Certainly in that first half there were chances for either side I think they probably had a lot of the possession but you probably had the better chances They had the best possession the best pressure we had the best chances mm. um, but I didn't want to carry on like that we had, we had a discussion at half time and although we had the best chances I didn't want to go through another 48, 49 minutes like that. Yeah. Um, and we, we did up the gears for a bit. Um, and then, of course, the sending off changes everything. And I'd rather have 11 men against 10. But it meant that, you know, what we did next, what they did next, it was a mess for another 10, 15 minutes for both sides. We're both trying to etch around, trying to find the best way to do it. Um, we lacked a bit of guile at the end we, we, with the patience and to break them down. But there's actually a strong win with us. And actually, it made it... It, that made it quite difficult in a way. But look, Chris made a brilliant save at the end from their mm. set piece in the box. Am I happy with the point? Yes, I am. Did the players try really hard? Yes, they did. Was it a bit of a mess? Yes, at times. Um, look, we go home and we've got a long trip home. And thank you to those 50 supporters that turned up. Um, that's just what a day for them as well. So I'm just glad we got something. Yeah. Two, yeah, uh, two red cards in the game in the end. What were your thoughts on both of them? I could see why, why the referee on the, 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 the Barrow sending off, I could see why there was a decision to be made. Um, and when you're on a yellow card like Luke was, you go to ground, he did win the ball. The referee yeah. said he won the ball. Yeah. But when one team had a player sent off, it's very easy to have another sent off on the other team. And if you're on a yellow card and you go to ground, you give the referee the opportunity. So. I mean, it was only 25 seconds to go when it happened, so there we are. I mean, it's, again, it was a mess, wasn't it? <laughs> the whole thing was a mess. So we've got a point and we've just got to, you know, we've just got to get ready for next week. An important point though, wasn't it? You, you didn't really want to come here and loot, come away with nothing today, with, especially with Barrow still fighting below you. Absolutely, and everything seemed to go against us in terms of the preparation for the game. So it's a point. I keep saying it's a point and it was a mess but we've got a point and we, we, it could have been a lot worse for us that's not going to help the uh, squad now either you, you're looking a little bit stretched as it is in numbers and yeah. the process is not going to have helped the situation no two yellows I, I guess that's one game mm. suspension so um, you know what's going to happen Tops, it'd, be, it'd be a topsy-turvy ups and downs between now and the end of the season the squad's got to deal with it good point today Thank you very much and safe travels home. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you very much.